Sue had a history of a different cancer, and so for that reason she was very diligent about undergoing all her screening examinations. She had a surveillance colonoscopy, at which time she was diagnosed with rectal cancer. It's really scary getting the diagnosis because it's all unknown, and I never knew anybody who had this, so you know, I had to do a lot of research, figure it out. At Loyola, all the patients with rectal cancer are treated through the GI Oncology Multidisciplinary uh, Tumor Board. They immediately, within a couple hours, assigned me to a group of doctors. Dr. Singer was one of them. I felt very lucky to get him because he's amazing. And um, Dr. Singer made the call that, let's go in quickly. I can get this spot before it penetrates the wall and get it out and then we'll test it and go from there. Some of the components of the enhanced recovery process that we really focus on here at Loyola include providing immunonutrition for our patients. This is something that patients can drink before surgery to support their immune system, which really reduces the chance of infection during and after surgery. We also focus on uh, prehabilitation, in other words, getting patients ready for surgery because we know uh, that patients who are in good physical condition before surgery do well after surgery. In the operating room, we focus on minimally invasive techniques, and the large majority of our patients are able to undergo either laparoscopic or robotic surgery, which shortens their stay in the hospital and their recovery at home. And then lastly, we focus on recovery uh, both in the hospital as well as once patients go home, concentrating again on physical activity, nutrition, uh, management of their wound, as well as management of their medical issues such as diabetes or hypertension. Uh, Sue's prognosis is excellent. She had an early stage tumor and was treated successfully with surgery and she's been doing quite well since then. Dr. Singer was so great. He took me through all the steps, everything that I should expect, everything that he was going to do in the surgery and after the surgery, what needed to be done. So I was really, really prepared um, for you know, what I needed to do.